Hey, thanks again for driving. Yeah, my pleasure. I usually do these kind of out-of-town jobs with Steve. But... Oh, yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. It's no big deal. Everything turn out all right with the baby? Yeah, totally. Smooth sailing. They have a little girl now. Oh, great. Yeah. That's great. My sister has a kid. Yeah. Ugly, ugly little thing. Oh. Looks exactly like that thing that came out of that guy's stomach in Total Recall. Quato. I told her she should name it that, too. She almost did. <laughs> I guess she thought it was a name for a South African tree or something. Huh. Watch it. Stay in your lane if you're going to be in that lane. Drive if you're going to drive. I'll drive here. Hey, do you know um, Paula in accounting? Paula. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think so. What is she like? She's pretty nice. Clean? Uh, what? You know, is she clean down there? This a guy could not be too careful these days. Make one little mistake and pew! I mean, they tell you in the pamphlets how much it burns, but you just never really know until you feel it for yourself. Call you up on the telephone, gonna get you all night, gonna take you home, take you home, take you home, take you home, take you home. Do you want to listen to the radio or something? Oh, the radio's broke. Hmm. Car wash took out the antenna. Sorry. Maybe a CD or something. Oh, yeah, I have uh, the history of Civil War as read by George C. Scott. Or the audio novelization of Footloose. Pop that in. I haven't heard that for a while. I was thinking more along the lines of music. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, here, hold the wheel. <laughs> It's uh, easy, easy, keep it on the road. Sorry. It's an electronica song I'm working on with this other guy. Do you know Tim Jenkins? He's like a count rep. No, no I don't. How about this one, take the wheel. <laughs> Hold on. Um. Oh, easy. Gosh. It was just no music for a little while. That's what you do. You put your hand up and you say no. You can just say no, but generally, this simple action. Put your hand up. That's what I learned. Works the best. Because I'm not a homophobe, and I, I resent and I take offense to any and all forms of homophobia. I was once called a gay wad, so I know how it feels. I was the lifeguard at the public pool, Brett. I was 14. And in all fairness, I had swallowed some water. And I had been misinformed as to when CPR was needed exactly. Nothing gay about it. Yeah, people can be so cruel. I, I mean, what are we when we are just so prejudiced because of another person's race, color, or creed? We're just we're not human, are we? No. We're what I call hate mutants. You know, I saw the band Creed live. They're pretty good. 
Yeah, it's just the term gay. I, that's why I don't use it. It's just meme. Yeah. Name calling. Unnecessary. Yeah. I just call them facts. What? That's what they call each other. It's fags. Hey, fag, you want to go get some chaps? Go to the leather bar tonight? Sure. Chaps it is, fag. They do it to themselves. They're taking it back. It's like the N-word. Fruit is also acceptable because it's delicious and provides the body with vital nutrients. Go if you're going to go. Fag. I gotta go to the bathroom. I think we could. Oh, well, yeah, if you want, you can put your urine in here. That's okay. No, I don't care. As long as I can use it. Wait, what? what you, why? It's my hobby. Horticulture. I use it on some of the plants. It helps ward off animals like chipmunks and birds. They get a whiff of that scent. Boy, they steer clear. They think of predators nearby. Okay, um, are you serious? Yeah. But they've grown accustomed to my urine, so I gotta mail away for urine on adult websites. It's disgusting. Yeah, tell me about it. I know. I got like 236 jars of urine in my basement. What am I gonna do with all those? I mean, I just, I don't need that much. I think I'll just hold it for now. Suit yourself. Yeah, I guess the client is rescheduling for tomorrow. It sucks! Yeah. Well, it's too late, we're not turning around. What do you mean? I'll oh, just get a hotel room. Really? Yeah. It'll be fun. I remember the last slumber party I was at, I got yelled at for hiding in the closet and watching my sister and her friends change. <laughs> she was so mad. It was totally worth it. Three months ago, she was just, oh, 